Oh, welcome back to Datras to play Astronauts. Let's get going. So we hit four derelicts last time. Found a reactor, but no liquid helium. So, okay. given the scarcity of things over there, we're going to come back up here to uh, cardinal direction on the map here, our northeast. Um, I don't know whether that's spinward or anti-spinward. I'm not sure where we are in relation to the Earth, honestly. I think that's what the red line is. Um, and hit these derelicts up here. So let's go ahead and do just that. pretty good and we got a ways to go so we should be able to at least finish our one hydra because we are a pretty good ways out I hope everybody's doing well this morning I'm doing just fine I'd have a whole complete Hydra here. Maybe I will tackle the heater, the nav console. We'll just work our way toward the top of the screen while we're killing time in between derelicts. Still on the hunt for a helium-3 tank. Once we get that, we're going to try and fit the ship a bit so we can do the AI gig. As I understand it, I need power from the reactor which is great we should be able to wrangle that but I also need some place where I can make it very 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 cold so we'll have to expand our ship maybe with a little exterior cabin and a door double doors I'm not sure we'll uh, we'll figure it out so I think we're going to finish up the Hydra here. We're going to eat and drink. Say that. Wow. All right. Yeah, those, uh, those repairs are no joke. Oh, well, that's fine. That's the Cyber Crow. We were already past you. All right, let's eat and drink while we're thinking about it. Let's see if that will get rid of our thirst. Very good. There should be some food over here. Hopefully in the fridge. Alright, we got lots of water. <laughs> we will take the circuit breakers out of there. The motherboards, excuse me. One of you's got food. Okay, so there we go. We will eat our trenchers. All right, so we are good now. Let's get on back to repair. So I've been making, since we get some time to kill, we're making a bunch of shorts, mostly MechWarrior 5 stuff. But I've been thinking about doing them for astronauts too, because I think a minute or less is pretty good for little bits of lore, like the, the trenchers folks. You know, where everything about you know, the, the slogan is what, 100% edible or something along that lines. I think those would be kind of fun to make. This is in, uh, I use DaVinci Resolve. Uh, and this has been in an effort to learn Resolve better. Making lots of little bitty things. at least for me, is a better way to learn. Because I can do them over and over and over again really quick. I can use the same tools repeatedly in rapid succession. It helps me commit it to memory. So 
So repair is no joke. And it's taking the heater as long to repair as it took the Hydra. Nav console, I imagine, is going to be just as thorny. And then that other Hydra. Alright, we're now at 23. I think we have a little bit still before the vendor restocks. And this is a man, this is a bit of a haul between derelicts, which is great. Get to do a little bit of refit, repair. I'm also, talking about audio from the last time, I've changed my noise gate, limiter, compressor settings a bit. I think it sounds a little more natural. And it will hopefully, you know, I'm not going to be able to completely get rid of the uh, clacky noises on the keyboard and clicking from the mouse because of where I've got everything situated, plus mechanical keyboard. Uh, but I've noticed as I, I spot check recordings, I don't hear them as much, which I think is a win. All right, just about done with the heater. And then we'll check and see where we are. Because we've got to be close. Very good. And we're still getting there. Alright, we need to yeah, we need to alter course a bit. Good enough. And we need to come about just a bit. Yeah, not gonna get much better than that. Let's get past whatever the toasted bebop and see if we get a proximity warning. Yeah, we do. Alright, we're only 20k out at 16x. We'll, we'll be there in just a moment. Uh, Eastern Promise. Dude, you best not be docking on my ship. I'm super, super salty about that. It's at this point in the game that I'm wishing for guns. Get off of my ship. As you were coming in, I could put a couple across your bow. That's the first time I've seen that happen. That's a, that's pretty cool gameplay. Alright, we may leave that alone then and head on up here because I have no idea how long Eastern Promise is going to hang out. Let's change our bearing. Good enough. And give it a little bit of go juice. We have plenty of power, plenty of remass. It would be really nice to have a reactor so we could choose those batteries. But, can't always get what you want. Let's get that nav console repaired. And then we'll hit up the Hydra. And then maybe the reactors, just to see. Let's go and see where we are. Uh, 
Very good. Too much. There we go, that looks pretty good. Bearing's just about zero and cross velocity is just about zero. 800 meters in closing. 300 meters. And call it good. All right, let's go see what's what. Let me look in here, yep. 24 and 83, that's good. Let's get on in here. Hey, battery, I'll take that. Uh, we're gonna open that chest. And probably we're gonna take that chest because I need somewhere to store tools. And I don't have another one of those. Let's keep wandering. Nitrogen tanks, nothing doing. Ooh, it's a big ship. What are you? Oh yeah. We'll refit you. That's great. Uh, we're going to leave the scrubby coveralls. Speaking of toolboxes I don't quite have. There's a nav console. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's the Axis Transit again. Let's see what's in here. Just to see. Uh, I will take a patch. You know, like the little patch kit would be kind of an interesting uh, bit of lore. Yeah, there's another. I'm going to grab another screeny here real quick. Oop, hang on. I need to save the old one. We're going to stick that one on the desktop too. Close those guys up. Okay. So I think there's nothing here for me. Which is too bad, but it's all right. That's part of the discovery. Let's get ourselves out of here. And I'm going to put the crate sort of right there. I take all of that. I come right here and I'm going to get all of you. I'm going to come back to the crate and drop them all in there. Very good. And I'm going to take you. I'm just going to drop you on the ground for now. Same thing for all these little miscellaneous bits and pieces. We'll come back to them. I'm going to restore that box. And I'll probably move tools into that. That way, tools are in the toolbox. And that'll be easy for me to remember. In the interim... Let's see where we go on here. Not the finest, but the most enthusiastic. Okay. We will make a swing through here. Let's do that. Let's get ourselves undocked. Nope. I want map controls. All right. Now, hopefully, we can thrust right on away. 
I'm going to guess that we can based on our orientation. Very good. And let's continue our repairs. So, a little bit of RNG bad luck here, but it's okay. We've seen lots and lots of new things, which is pretty good. I'm happy we scored another toolbox. That's great. Our pressure warnings only go mildly instead of just full bore 24-7. Okay. That's as much repair as we're going to get before we get to our next one. I see how we're going now. Yeah. So we get our bearing straight, and then we get our velocity straight. Well, we're going to slow way down because this wasn't an unknown. This was a. This was a known. Is this? Are we just passing somebody? Is that what's going on? Let's give it a look. That is correct. We're going here. That's on me. All right, no worries. I guess I flew right past it. That's okay, we'll be there in just a moment. Oh, one of the new things that, uh, yeah, this changed. That's pretty good. I wish there were a little, uh, you know, a little up arrow to show that QE is rotating you about uh, a Z axis for your 2D. All right, where are we looking? Wrong way. That's really nice too. Oh, hang on. What are we, yeah, no, no, no. Oh no, there we go. <laughs> That's pretty cool, I like it. So I guess this guy's got a little bit of rotation going on him. Slowing down though, getting there. Okay, better, better. This guy was tough to line up. 500 meters or so. Closing up. 250. 100. Come on. There we go. Good, good, good. Let's go see what's on this one. One day we're going to find it. Might not be today, but we're going to find it. Alright, what's in the crate? Patch kit. Uh, you know what? We're going to take that. Everybody else can hang out. I uh, say that. What is the condition of my grill bar? Okay. So, not in a condition to worry about. Uh, also, I think... I think I might want to put you here. I'm gonna try that. Yeah, there's that access transit. 
Alright, but I think I've got enough screenshots of that to feedback to the devs. And that's all, you know. That's it's kind of a visual bug, I don't think that's a big deal. So I would expect that to get triage pretty low, unless it's just a two second fix. Oh, what are you? Oh, busted power drill. Okay. Yes, I need something like this sort of outer gantry walkway to store that AI core because it gets super hot. Alright, I'm getting nothing here. Can we get around to there? Certainly can. But you are picked clean, my friend. Okay. Let's get on out of here. station use very good all right where are we going next we're gonna make a swing up this way let's bring ourselves about very good Give ourselves a little bit of go and get ourselves lined up as best we can and continue to work on the nav station. So I think maybe I should install a pump this way. Just to, just to shut everybody up. Well, you're... You are an air pump and you're in here. Oh, you're empty. That's why we're complaining. All right. Why well, you didn't fill? Hmm. All right. We'll tackle that. Well, you're full, so let's go ahead and... Actually, let's go ahead and do that. Let's do that now. I'm going to say gas canister, uninstall. Ah, shoot. All right. We'll get docked and then we'll, we'll square that up. Very good. Bring ourselves about just a, not that much. Eighty, ninety. That's just. Uh, we got our auto save at just the wrong time. Let's see what we get. There we go. All right, we're at one one and a half k out. meters everybody's looking good 400 meters 100 meters nope huh. I clicked and dragged and it decided to not click it's okay that's on me let's come over here and get this canister off thank you good now I want to install you right there
And we're just going to drop you on the ground. Check the control panel. Uh, your auto. And you're tied to an input, right? Yes. Okay, good. Let's get on in there. We'll see what's what. I see. All right, we can pry this one. That's great. How are we looking? Mm, battery charger. Might be an okay take. Uh oh. Oh, there's lots here. All right, we're gonna come back here. I'm betting this is nav. But rather than, uh... Oh, I gotta uninstall it, huh? Well, I guess I don't have to. I could probably find the nav station, but I'm betting it's behind this door. Get all the codes, fix the electronics. Eh. Wow. Just a crate. We're gonna find Summer Glow in there. We're gonna find nothing in there. Lots of thrusters, that's interesting. A couple of batteries. Nothing I gotta have. I'm gonna uninstall this guy too. Still faster than wiring everything up. There's a nav console and smash, so couldn't get lock, couldn't get access codes anyway, even if we wanted them. Not without a great deal of effort. Let's keep on walking north. Top of the map, I guess, as it were. That's another crate. We're gonna leave B for now. All right. Oh, we can go all the way around there. Interesting. There's a fridge. Yeah, let's check. What's in the fridge? Yeah, we're going to take that. Let me eat those first. Alright, we're, okay, we're getting a pretty good haul for food, if nothing else. But, I think that's it. Well, let's open this up. Still can't pry it. Okay. Twenty-three percent O2, seventy-five percent battery. We're okay. And nothing doing. All right. And we can uninstall that. We certainly will. But it looks like it's just going to be gantry around the outside of the ship. We'll see. Nothing doing. Just me and Fred Johnson hanging out here on the edge. All right. Oof, rough couple of episodes, but we'll figure it out. There's nothing to be done down here, correct? Yeah. You're running only on batteries. And I don't think there's anywhere, yeah, nowhere for me to go. I am going to take this guy out of here. And then we will repair it later, but it'd be nice to have a backup. We could put it in another part of the ship. Something like that. Trying to have as many redundant systems as I can, especially with things uh, breaking down now. Uh, 
Okie dokie. We're just going to put you down sort of right there. And we're at, wow, we're already at 30 minutes. Time flies. All right, I'm going to end the episode here. In the next episode, we're going to continue on the hunt for a liquid helium tank with our eventual goal being the uh, AI gig. If you've got any tips or tricks for me, I'd love to hear them. As always, thanks for watching.